Hello again, this time Canyon CF. Let's start from the front. Guide R RCC brakes, which are one of the best brakes you can get. Very wide handlebar matching the frame, the co color of the frame, cerulean blue or whatever you want to call this blue blue color chemical 31.8 octane handlebar there it goes here lock mechanism is here that's the pike from RockShock 160 right there 15 axle with a huge disc 200 it's humongous Caliper wheels are DT Swiss spline 27 and a half tire are Maxis, one of the best tires you can get. Rotation right there, pretty thick tire. Okay, Strife CF. There's nothing under the frame. This part is a little loose, but it is what it is. Some kind of sticker right there. Bike category M size. Okay, that's the aluminium uh, seat post. Nago Evo Pro logo. Saddle with carbon fiber rails, like you can see, and there's the damper Kashima coat damper. Air goes here, and there, uh, race face next crank, carbon fiber crank, but a light crank. Let's see the brake guide. 12 axle of course official supporter I don't know what this is all about but it is what it is let's see another side and that's another side I don't know why, why I said that but it is what it is lock mechanism is right there like a swish watch I said before it's 160 see red bond is right there also working very nice DT Swiss Axel uh, Hube not Axel, Axel is uh, Maxel Axel that's the front tire high roller Okay, let's see the frame from this side. That. Carbon fiber frame, of course. Uh, the front is carbon, the back is uh, aluminium. I think this part is aluminium. Shape shifter. Shape shifter. Yeah, because uh, you can change the shape of the frame. I will uh, show you this in a few seconds. Custom tuned. Three different settings here. Yep. Race face crank. I love the design of those race face cranks. The carbon fiber is working extremely well. 36. It's 11 speed. SLX on the back. Let's hear it. God damn! Extremely nice. Uh, don't don't go, don't go. Uh, bike is moving. Too much wind. Sorry for the wind noise. I have to pause the video because the bike won't stay still. 
Come on. Okay, now it's steady. Oh, damn. Very nice sound. Okay, let's put it on the scale. But first, wait. I want to show you how to change the uh, frame. Frame. Uh, I will show you one, one second. So, like, you can see now it's on green. Shape of the frame, yeah. That's why they call it shape shift. I will use this. Uh, Lock mechanism, or whatever you want to call it. Let me go back a little bit. Put the camera on the stand. No editing. <laughs> I think I need to edit this. And now it has a different shape. Now all you need to do to go back is press this uh, lever on the handlebar. Uh, sorry for the shaking camera. And it's back on the old shape. Okay, let's put this uh, bicycle on the scale. Let's see how heavy it is. And the scale says 13 kilograms, 420 grams. So it is pretty. So it's not uh, very uh, very heavy, but it's not super light. Bear in mind, this is a uh, uh, enduro bike. So for enduro bike, this uh, 13 and a half kilogram is extremely good. Okay. I think the bike is moving, so I, I, I have to go. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.